and in the midst of household chaos, sick children, and an overload of homework that I am currently working on, I would like to play with my QuickTime player, screen recording, and provide you guys a little tutorial on my favorite new technology. And just to uh, put it out there, first of all, this um, here is uh, the version of Mac or the version of Microsoft Word that I'm using. So it's Word for Mac 2011. So just as long as that's clear, I don't know if this option is available to all of you. But if it is, it's great. So here's the project I'm currently working on using um, what's it called? We're gonna we're gonna find out because we're gonna open a new document from a template. We're going to go to all templates and your second option is a Word notebook layout. So the blank layout looks like this and you can put your title here and as you can see it looks just like a notebook. So you can double click on or ah highlight this section and name it whatever so pottery blah and then here you have the option of doing bullet points leveled bullet points you can then switch this to a number format or an outline format if you choose which is super cool and you've got multiple sections in your document that you can access easily. Now I'm going to close this particular file and show you what I'm working on because it's more applicable to us. So close and don't save. And then here is my I think mod for, yeah, uh, my module for Pottery 2.1 assignment. So my first tab here, I have actually imported, inserted a movie straight from a file that was saved on my hard drive. And I can right click on that and play that. And we're just going to skip into the business here. I, yeah. I don't really want to share that whole interpretation because it's not that great. Um, but I think it's pretty cool that we can in, that we can integrate the video right in there. And then when I go to my next tab, I am starting my study questions, and I'm just I'm just going to answer all my study questions there. And then for section three, I could do this. I think I'm going to have to do this on VoiceThread as well, but. I have the option of making this a reflection and um, I'm not sure how I'm really going to do this for now but just as an example. And here I have the option of, this is too cool, I can insert audio notes. So I'm going to be recording with two separate devices. Not sure if this is going to work out right, but um, as you can see, it's picking up my voice with the microphone, and we're going to record. Hello, this is my reflection for Pottery 2.1, and this is a test. Blah, blah, blah. I don't know. I'm not very creative when it comes to this kind of impromptu stuff. Anyway, stop, and now... And we're going to record. Whoa, this is my reflection for... <laughs> Ridiculous. Um, but anyway, so as you can see, the audio note has been um, integrated into the document. And you can mouse over where the audio is. So just, you know, a future note. You might want to put reflection here you know with an arrow or something because it's not obvious but uh, when you mouse over it there's your speaker and we're going to record 
Discord. Whoa, this is my reflection for Patchy 2.1. Okay. So, yep, that's the overall on the notebook layout document in Microsoft Word. And you can just put your entire assignment into one document. And I think it's amazing. So there's our tutorial, and I'm gonna cut it. I'm gonna cut it off here because I have homework to do. And we'll see you all later. Bye.